My name is Seth Maskett. My book is called The Inevitable Party. I'm chair of the political science department here at the University of Denver, and my area of focus is American politics, uh, with particular focus on uh, political parties, state and local politics, and campaigns and elections. The book is a look at several different attempts to reform political parties or even uh, get rid of political parties. Washington railed about uh, the, the possible bad effect of parties. Uh, Madison and Jefferson and others were talking about how poor parties were and you know the, the, the founders railed against them in some of the early documents. And yet those very same people were actually forming parties within just a couple of years of the government being up and running. The Romans were concerned that parties were just some sort of conspiracies. Um, this has been going on in uh, republics and democracies for a very long time. States have tried a lot of weird different things with ways to either rein in parties or get rid of parties. Uh, Nebraska and Minnesota, for example, have experiences with um, having completely nonpartisan legislatures. Certainly the Republican Party right now on the national level is going through a major identity crisis. More likely than not, there will be some attempts to reform that party. There will be probably a number of Republicans who were concerned with the way their presidential nomination system went this year, um, suggesting it was, it was too easy for uh, someone like a, a famous billionaire to just jump in and run for office. There'd be a lot of reform suggested. What my book sort of offers to that conversation is, well, let's actually think through uh, what these parties are and what sort of uh, unintended consequences might be the result of these elections and these reforms. We might end up by making the situation actually worse.